an escape from big city life in the small mountain town of Huntsville, home to J.R. Johansson for more than 40 years. I love my little, my little heaven out there. A man who enjoys the simple life, especially in his backyard studio where he spends his retirement years painting. I may get a little emotional. But for J.R., these portraits are dear to the heart. There's something about painting someone who's passed away. 73-year-old J.R. paints portraits of LDS missionaries who lost their life while serving. For J.R., this is much more than just painting on a piece of canvas. It's about bringing to life. This is Elder Roundy. Let me tell you what I know about him. A son or daughter who's dearly loved and missed by so many. He was a very energetic young man, always doing something, but he, he dove into his mission. J.R. says, it's as if the missionary is there to help guide his hands. I was pretty certain they were present because of things that have happened while I was painting. One of those experiences involved Elder Jeremy McCauley, who passed away in May of last year. During that painting process, I learned a technique that I'd not used before. Come to find out that the young man was an artist. That technique, a different way of smudging. Elder Macaulay, he was the one who taught me this. I swear, he was, he helped me paint his portrait. I painted his portrait in less than four hours. To date, JR has painted 41 missionaries. And that's my baby, Connor. Sydney Threadgold's son was painting number three for JR. Connor and his companion passed away in August of 2014 from carbon monoxide poisoning while serving in Taiwan. Cindy remembers a day she got the news. That's not something you ever want to have happen. But this painting has brought new peace and comfort. That's like looking at Connor, literally looking straight at his little face. In some cases, Hi, I'm Nika. JR is able to personally deliver the painting. This will be the first time the Roundies have seen the finished product. <sighs> Hi, Dan. <laughs> You're come Hi. right out of the picture. <laughs> and this reaction is why JR paints these missionaries free of charge. A young life cut short, brought to life again by a Vietnam vet who suffers from his own health issues but is healed through painting. I think it's keeping me alive, to be honest.